Take some advice from a jaded vet. Your social media presence is weaker than a fan's memory of one of your TBD shows. If you want to generate some buzz online, the best way to do that, aside from shortening your name, of course, is to make big moves. Show off those epic moves in a match full of finishers, and you'll flood the feeds, dominate the discourse, and start trending like a clip of a controversial celebrity cat dancing for charity. Welcome a superstar who defines tenacious, brave, and driven. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making her way to the ring from Newcastle upon Tyne, England. Ew! The look of determination on Cap's face speaks volumes, Corey. This is a woman looking to climb all the way to the top of WWE. It's good to have goals, but we're just going to have to see if she has what it takes to make the climb. I have my doubts. It's time for Indy Cred to be put to the test. Tegan Knox looking ready for a fight. Yeah, she wants to show this crowd what she can do. And from the Welsh Valleys, Tegan Knox. Well, Tegan was betrayed by her former best friend, Dakota Kai, in the first ever women's war games match. All that says to me is that Tegan Knox simply isn't a very good best friend. Saxton? Saxton? That was my comment. Saxton? Well, a feel-good story every time Tegan Knox competes. As this one starts, I've heard rumblings that allegedly Cap is going to try to hit multiple finishers in this match tonight. A strategy like that could create the kind of online buzz that gets noticed by the WWE Universe. If she wins. Otherwise, Cap will be on the wrong end of all your favorite memes. Boot right in the jaw. That's going to fire you up with anger. Close line! She's fighting back. Boom! Oh, what an uppercut. Jarring. Ah. Might take her head clean off her shoulders. Uh-oh. And a suplex. From the middle rope. Oh, what a splash. Quickly to cover. Raising the arm before one. Not even close to down and out at this point. German suplex. Vicious right hand. Smashing their face into the mat. Plenty of hits coming her way now. DDT spike. Just a relentless assault from Knox. Tegan Knox at full throttle looks nearly unstoppable. Driven down face first. Oh, wicked kick to the lower back. From the top, she comes up empty. And Tegan's laid out. Suplex. As the legs wrapped, Fisherman Suplex. Uh oh. What are they going to do here? How about a little gory special? Think about all the pain she's in right now. She's looking for a way out. She's freezing herself into an arm drag takedown. a 
Instant counter for Knox. Mm. Oh my God. Oh, this, this superstar using the rope as a weapon. This is uncalled for. If a shortcut presents itself, you better take it. She has her target weighed and measured. Uh-oh, we know what's next. Oh, man, into the neck breaker. Oh, that can certainly do it. Got a win here tonight. That'll change your career. Here is your winner. We're feeling a defeat washing over Tegan Knox here. Tegan Knox has been knocked down before, but don't forget, she always finds a way to get up and come back for more. How are you feeling? I don't want you to get too down on yourself. Sometimes people just don't click. What are you talking about? I mean, let's be honest. You haven't gotten as over with the fans as we'd like you to be. You must have been feeling the disconnect. I wasn't feeling it, but I am now. Don't worry about it, though. Some people have long, fulfilling mid-card careers. And we probably won't release you. But if you ever want to be considered in the title picture, I'm going to need you to really dig into the team's ideas. Troy, the ideas you've brought me are dumb. They're clearly not helping me connect with the fans. They're not dumb. You just haven't committed enough. I want to see you try to try harder. Try to try harder? That's your advice? Are you serious? That and to wear the new gear I had designed for you. Trust me, a new look will change everything. Troy, I told you when you pitched it to me before, I'm not wearing that gear. <sighs> What's the problem? They used to call you the captain in TBD, right? I've heard that name around here too. And Regal won't be happy if you don't wear the gear. You're telling me Regal wants me to wear that? Sure! Troy? Well, he may not know the details, but he wants me to help you. So, like it or not, I've been deputized. When you're ready to enthusiastically try this, I've got a match for you against Shayna Baszler. Fine. I don't like it. In fact, I very enthusiastically don't like it. But I'll do it. Please let the record reflect my enthusiasm. Glad to hear it, Captain. Trust me, fans are gonna eat this up. Oh, and I forgot to mention, it's going to be a five minute time limit match. Just a little cramped for time tonight. I'm sure you understand. <laughs> You're kidding me. I am not. Have fun out there. The captain is sporting a real look right now. The following is scheduled for one fall. Making our way to the ring from Newcastle upon Tyne, England. Maybe Cap's goal is to take her opponent on a cruise. Brilliant strategy. I'm just saying, keep underestimating this woman. She will keep proving you wrong. After sailing the seven seas, the captain is ready to come ashore.
school classic bruiser brutality catch style wrestling skill. Yeah, years of training has led to singles and tag team success here in WWE. No doubt one of the most dangerous women you'll find in the entire division. A purveyor of discount dental work under the WWE umbrella. No stranger to championship gold, Baszler has to be eyeing this as an opportunity to raise her stock in WWE. I fully believe that titles and wins are just bonuses for Shayna. What she really likes is the fight itself. It'll be interesting to see how Cap will perform with her new, well, let's just call it attitude. The captain better keep her sails tight and bearing dead ahead, or else she'll run into the iceberg that is Shayna Baszler. Well, new costume or not, I think Cap will bring the same level of intensity we've come to expect from her. Textbook scoop slam. Ah, Baszler, so devastating. Stop right to the arm. Oh, break an arm. Oh, impressive counter. Oh, spinning heel kick. How to rock anybody. A slap. Adding a level of insult with that kind of physicality. Nice butterfly suplex. And she's stunned in the corner. A handstand and now using his foot to his advantage. On the running double knees. Going way up high. We're going to finish it off. Swanton bomb. Shayna looking to loosen the grip of her opponent. Baszler's toughness needs to kick in here. Exploder suplex. Is it enough? Quick shoulder up. Kicking out so early certainly sends a message. Hammerlock applied. Oh, no, no. Uh-oh. Oh. Feeling the WWE Universe on another level. This is her fuel. Oh, it didn't go as planned there. Shayna there keeping that stream of offense in check. Yeah, Shayna able to stop that surge dead in its tracks. What a counter against Shayna. Ripcord applied. Oh, and a forearm. Oh, turned that around and planted them. She's firing up, no doubt about it. At this point, this is incredibly ill-advised. You're in the middle of a match. Great counter by Baszler. Caught the leg. The leg is, oh man, right on the jaw. Out of room. Oh, A tremendous pinning combination. Goal! As she's got it, got her shoulders down. Cover! An emphatic victory. Here is your winner. And that seemed like a pretty easy day at the office right there. Baszler ticked off now, and that only means she's going to come back meaner.
Should I ask? Do you have to? Should I call you Skipper? <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Honestly, I can't with you. <laughs> I said sorry. But you totally can with me. Otherwise, you wouldn't be here to drown your sorrows in the small pond that is TBD. <sighs> is it that Troy guy again? Yep. And I can't even get a word in with Regal to talk about my concerns. I get he's busy, but come on. Huh. It's not like you to have trouble getting people to pay attention to you. What's the issue? I'm doing everything right, but I can't seem to catch a solid break. I don't want to just be on the roster. I want to climb to the top. So you came home to complain at me. It is kind of our thing. True story. At least whenever there used to be issues on the road or here in TBD, we'd put our heads together and figure it out. I can stand on my own, but it's a lot more fun to tread through the muck with you. Well, are you having any at least? Any what? Fun? A lot of the time, yeah. I still love wrestling and putting my all into matches. But the backstage politics feel like a chore sometimes. You're the one who told me to take advantage of this opportunity. I told you to say yes to the adventure, not to overthink it. Honestly, I think you're holding back a little. Remember your debut? You didn't care about what anyone thought. You just went out there and the WWE universe loved every unfiltered second of it. You have great instincts. But you're trying too hard to toe the line. It's throwing you off. So you think I need to try to try less hard? You know what they say about trying to please everyone. Everyone will love me and I'll be wildly successful. All I'm saying, the captain I know would trust her instincts and speak up if something didn't feel right for her, regardless of the consequences. He certainly would have with me. Whether it was in the ring... Or on a boat? Geneva, I'm leaving. Fine, fine, I'll leave you be. Hit me up if you need anything. I think I got what I needed. I'll give doing what they want another chance, but I'll make sure to say my piece too. Thank you. Commanding the ring and forging her path, the captain. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making her way to the ring from Newcastle upon Tyne, England. Cap has been making waves ever since her WWE tryout. If by waves you mean doing a great job of making the rest of the locker room suspicious of her motives, then yeah, sure. Cap is on a mission tonight. One of the greatest women to ever step in the ring, Natalia. And from Calgary, Alberta, Canada, Natalia! Yeah. Natalia, a product of the famed Heart Dungeon, but she's made her own legacy in WWE. Natalia has been one of the most dominant superstars in the women's division ever. You know, we've seen Natalia's confidence shaken a few times as of late. She's had some tough roadblocks in her path. 
If I know Natty, she's laser focused on smashing through the obstacles and regaining that confidence. The captain has not been lighting the world on fire as of late. Maybe if she could fish out a victory from Natalia, it could really turn her ship around. Cap has serious potential. I don't think she deserves all of these nautical jokes. I actually agree with you, Saxton. In fact, Natalia better get her bulkhead on straight, or this super starboard will have her tied up in knots and capsized in no time. Oh, why do I even try? She sent flying into the corner. Ouch. Oh, this is unique. Got him seeing shadows. Expected that one. Set up for the throw oh. leg sweep. Nicely done. Oh, putting focus on the arm here. Oh, and she got out of there. Back body drop. I don't even know how gravity allowed that to happen. Insane strength to send someone airborne like that. Oh! Butterflies the arms. Nice butterfly suplex. Amazing how smooth that looked. Must be hitting the weight room hard if you can suplex that much weight. Oh yeah, she is really getting fired up. Quick sidestep by Natalia. Outside of the ring now. What's the plan here? Uh-oh, this is not going to be good. Oh, oh leg breaker. She throws her back in. Go behind. German suplex. Made her pay for her mistake. Reversal after reversal, proving they did their homework. Slips out of the way there. What reflexes? Double underhook into a DDT. Fez press. Nothing was being held back with each of those strikes. A oh, timely counter by Natalia. All wrapped up. Picture perfect. Fireman's carry. Shot to the gut will break things up. Oh, ouch. Nasty roundhouse kick. Natalia's locked up. Oh, Natalia wasn't ready. Now it could be. And that's it. The captain has sunk the boat's battleship with some. Oh, not again. Is this really how you see me? You know what? I've done everything they've asked of me. I've done everything you all have asked of me. Wearing dumb gear, playing nice with appearances, taking bad advice from WWE veterans. <sighs> and you know what I've realized? No one knows my potential better than me. I am not just a spoke on this wheel. <sighs> And I am not going to wait until I'm at rock bottom to take control of my future. This is my story. And I'm taking it back. Are we still on? What do you think you're doing? If you think you can just do whatever you want without any consequences, I... <laughs> that felt really good. It was certainly unexpected. I don't recall a promo being planned for this evening. I already told her. Shut up, Troy. I don't recall a promo being planned. 
Haven't seen that sort of fire from you since your debut. I'm not apologizing for what I said. I don't recall anyone asking you to. But if you have more comfortable places to be than WWE, I'd be happy to release you from your contract. That's how it's gonna be. Yes, there have to be consequences for- Shut, Shut up, up Troy. Troy. But I have to ask, why did you sign with WWE in the first place? Sir? Did you sign here to be comfortable? I didn't sign here to dog and pony show dumb creative decisions or feel like I should be thankful for every scrap. You're a talented wrestler, but you can do that anywhere. If you came to WWE to be a superstar, to do what you can only do somewhere with the reach of WWE. To not just do the work, but to live the fantasy. I'm going to give you the greatest gift I can offer. <laughs> Best of luck in her future endeavors. Shut, Shut up, Troy. Troy. Freedom. Get uncomfortable. Take big swings. Not just in the ring, but out of it. You want to be a WWE superstar? I think you might just have it inside you. Just promise me three things, and I'll have your back every step of the way. What's that? Put your whole heart into it, and don't be afraid to fail. It'll hold you back if you only attempt what you know you can do. Do those things, and I'll make sure your spot here is safe. Whatever happens. So, what do you think? I'm intrigued. And I'm in. Brilliant. But that was only two things. What's the third? Oh, right you are. Promise me you'll never wear that ridiculous outfit. That I never approved ever again. That won't be a problem. You've got yourself a deal.